getting off to a late start, but I'm gonna make lunch. I think I'm gonna make like a veggie noodle soup. It's really, really cold in Boston right now. It's the day after St. Patty's Day. Um, there's still snow on the ground, I'll show you. I don't know if you can see it yet. So there, there's still snow on the ground from that blizzard this past week. Um, I'm thinking about going to West Elm later just to look at some furniture bits. I was gonna film something today, but my back's been bothering me for the past few days. Um, I think I slept on it weird or something, but I'm gonna go see a chiropractor tomorrow. I stayed up late and worked on this last night. It's not finished yet, but um, I think just a few more things to add, like to touch up on. I got this from West Elm. I ordered it online, came larger than I thought, but I do really like the color. And then I got this snake plant recently, like full plant mom mode here. I've been picking up a lot of plants, but I'm really glad that this guy is in my life. So the reason why I'm like making that calla lily painting is because I want to cover up this wall. I want to get rid of this tapestry. This is just sort of like a temporary thing um, that I want to fill up with like hopefully a gallery wall, but art is expensive, yo. And I think I'm just gonna make some stuff and like put them up and then eventually maybe I'll get some framed artwork as well. And of course I am watching Parks and Rec. I'm starving so I'm gonna get cooking. I am snacking on pork cracklings while I am making lunch, but I did have a smoothie this morning, so it's really just all about balance, and my noodle soup is actually pretty healthy, so, you know, sometimes you gotta snack a little. So this is it. So this is what I usually have for dinner, but I've never actually made it for lunch before. Um, it's not vegan, but it's very close because I use like a fish dashi, but um, it's just like a miso soup with noodles. And there are like two types of mushroom in there. There's the gnocchi, the maitake. I have some tomatoes in there, some broccoli, some spinach. There's some scallions lying around. Um, and obviously I finished it with sriracha because you gotta, but yeah, this is what I eat all the time and it's delicious. Just finished shooting my Everlane video. Did it in a very different format. So if you guys watch that, let me know what you think. I will link it in one of the cards up here. So yeah, let me know what you think about that one. I kind of made a mess. So now I need to clean up. So I'm actually gonna go out now. I'm, I really need a cup of coffee. Might stop for a donut, but I think I'm gonna leave my camera at home because I plan to go to West Elm and I think maybe the art store and if I end up like buying stuff, I don't wanna carry a bag with me, which I would need if I bring my camera with me. So I'm just gonna leave this at home. So I'm back home now. It's I've been out for like four hours, four and a half hours. My mom asked me to hang out last minute. Looked at West Elm, didn't really get anything. I didn't really buy anything except a ruler, which I know is completely random, but um, yeah, I did that. And then we went to Eventide to get a lobster roll. That was delicious. And now I think I'm just gonna, just gonna change into my PJs and just like watch TV or something. Hey guys, it's Saturday. It's a little after two o'clock right now. I just had brunch with my best friend's mom. Um, had some eggs benedict. I am in the midst of building some Ikea furniture. So I got a bench, let me show you. A bench that will hopefully look like this. And um, a stool over there that I haven't opened. And I just finished building this guy right here. There's just there's a lot of like packages that came in today and I also got just got these TM spinning shoes. So very, very excited. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep building for now. And of course I'm watching Parks and Rec while I'm doing house stuff. <laughs>
but this is what I just finished building. So it's a stool that I think I'm gonna put like another plant here. Um, I need to go shop for plants. I thought it was gonna be a little bit taller, but that's okay. So everything I got today was from Ikea. So I don't know which side looks better. So that's here. Um, let's see. And then here's the bench that I just put together as well. That's like right by the window with all my other plants. I, yeah, I need a little bit more plants, but I really like it. It matches in with like the rest of my furniture. Again, don't mind the mess. And this is a thing that I built earlier. This was, they were all pretty easy to um, assemble, so. And now I need to clean all of this up. So much packaging. <laughs> Sunday afternoon, I guess, early afternoon. There's a little bit of snow going on outside, light flurries, but I just got back from a spin class, just made my smoothie. I woke up a little hungover. I went out last night with my best friend and had a few too many drinks, but spin class was good. I think that helped. I always don't want to go when I'm hungover, but I feel like it always helps. As long as like you don't need to throw up, I think it's actually not a bad idea anyway i'm gonna shower and then i'm gonna make lunch i think i'm gonna make fried rice because i have leftover rice and then i'm gonna do laundry fried rice is done i'm gonna have a very very late lunch now Or should I say? No, it's still morning. Um, today is the last day of March. It's actually really nice out today. It's really sunny. Um, I made myself a really large breakfast. So, scrambled eggs, avocado toast, having some tea. I'm thinking that today I'm gonna go to the Museum of Fine Arts because um, it's like the last weekend of this exhibition that I really want to see and I just haven't been in a while. So after breakfast, I think I'm gonna get myself a coffee and then just head to um, the museum and, you know, spend the day there. And then my friend um, is back in town from London, so I think I'll see her later tonight. I don't really have that much going on today. I think I'm just gonna, I was gonna shoot my March favorites today, but I feel like I don't really have a lot of time today, so I think I'll try to do that tomorrow and just upload it a little bit later. So I'm enjoying my coffee now. I'm gonna have some chocolate. If you guys have never had this, it's delicious. I don't know how to say, is it Vogus? Vogues? You see that? Uh, focus, there we go. Um, so this one has like almonds and uh, sea salt, really good stuff. I think I'm gonna like sit in bed for a little bit and um, I started the first episode of the newest Dave Chappelle special. I'm gonna start the second episode now. I don't know if I'm gonna, uh, maybe I shouldn't watch it. I don't know, maybe, uh, like, it, uh, what am I trying to say? So I feel like if you, or if I start a comedy special, I like to sit for the whole thing and not like pause it sometimes as I do with movies. But it is kind of early. If I finish it, I can still go to the museum. It closes at five. It's not super close to me, but I'm just having one of those days where it's, I'm just like not sure what to do. Um, I ran last night because I'm running a five mile race in May. Um, I'm actually doing a fundraiser as well for that. I'll link that down below if you guys want to donate um for that um so i'm starting to train to like just start running again because i haven't really been doing that i've only been spinning but i'm really excited to do that but my legs are a little bit sore today so i think i'm just really tired and don't really want to move but i should because it's lovely outside 
I just picked up some stuff from the post office, the Everla some new Everlane items, and I'm actually headed, really headed to the museum now. back home it's almost six now I got really hungry actually I should put on some water for tea I got really hungry on the way back and I decided to go to Tate if you're in Boston you should they're around they like they're around a lots of places ah. I got some pancakes because it sounded really good and I wanted something sweet I've never had this before it's like called um, I think Greek pancakes so it has like Greek yogurt and jam let's take a look oh my god it's huge okay are you ready I'm, I'm definitely not gonna finish this but take a look it's huge here's my hand for comparison like those are huge ass pancakes and I have fruit in the fridge so I think I'll eat fit like eat some of this now and then have some tomorrow and I got some monkey bread as well like I should never buy like food when I'm hungry but I got like monkey bread as well for breakfast I guess tomorrow and then this will be for now it comes with jam and honey I think yeah so it has jam Greek yogurt and let's see yeah this is basically like bread as I mentioned earlier, I picked up my um, my Everlane items from the post office. So I got the tank bra and bikini. I'm very excited because I've been waiting for them to come out with underwear for quite some time. I feel like the moment they come out with active wear is when I really go bankrupt because I will buy everything. Let's take a look. Oh, it's really hard to do this with one hand. Ooh. It definitely feels very, very nice and luxurious. Let me look at the underwear. I don't know if this might be too big for me. I got the small. I got black to begin with, and then we'll see what happens next. I think they're selling out very quickly already though. Yeah, so this is the bikini. It feels really nice. Um, it feels like very, it's like very smooth and slippery if that makes sense. The bra, it's like a thinner panel on the back and then a thicker in the front. I like these kind of bras because I don't like wires and I don't like padding. So this is what I generally look for in a bra. So I'm very excited. Um, I'll definitely let you know how I feel about these in an upcoming video. 
So I just thought I'd sit down for a second. I'm actually gonna um, close the vlog here. But um, yeah, so the museum I went to, the Museum of Fine Arts, um, it was like the last weekend of the, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this wrong, Mirakami Suji exhibit. Really, really cool, really immersive, like, like a very, very fun exhibit. Um, I'm sorry that I didn't go earlier, but um, if it does come to your town, I definitely recommend it. I saw some Rothko that um, is showing there now if you're in Boston. I definitely recommend going there. I love Rothko. They had like 11 pieces of his work. I saw some uh, MC Escher as well, and I think they brought in some Georgia O'Keeffe, who's like my all-time favorite artist. So I'm very glad that I went. It was nice to sort of like go out and do stuff and not just like go window shopping i guess which is what i usually do but i'm just my legs are killing me i think it's a terrible idea to walk around the day after you run or especially when you haven't ran in a while and you're trying to get back in shape sorry the sun's like in my face but it was yeah i it was really nice out i feel like i'm just babbling here it was really really nice out the food the pancake smells really good I was originally gonna get drinks or dinner with my friend, but I think it'll be tomorrow instead. Hopefully I'll be able to film the, um, what am I saying? My March favorites tomorrow. Oh, this really hurts. I, yeah, I don't really have a lot planned for April. I guess we'll just sort of be training for that race to raise money for ALS. So I'll be doing that. Hopefully the weather stays nice in Boston, but you never know. It's like, it's in the 50s today. It's nice that it's not like, like a weekly nor'easter anymore. That happened in March and that was such a bummer. But I think I'm just gonna maybe stay in and watch a movie. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat these pancakes now. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. Um, hopefully I'll get back into like, the routine of vlogging again or like monthly vlogging i kind of miss doing them and editing them they're kind of fun to edit but i will see you in the next video thank you so much for watching bye